I kind of like the older the one ones. Buried in the back. Yeah, this one. Um, how how tall or how big is it? I don't know. How many feet? Let's find out. What it says twenty six. Got a lot of space for when you're driving. Nice. What? It's 26 feet. Yeah. So 26. Wow, I like how big this is. Nice and bright. So what's the deal? 2005 Fleetwood. Ooh. Only 26,000 miles. I could do OOTDs in this, <laughs> in these mirrors. Ooh, lots of closet space. Now that's what I'm talking about. Yes. Sweetie, bring on the closet space for me. It's so funny. I'm talking about closet space. I literally wear the same thing every day. <laughs> uh, so ooh, big actually, fridge. I like like the open bright brightness of everything. I don't mind like the old style stuff. You know, it doesn't bother me. I think like if we painted this stuff, like all the wood, painted it white, it'd really open it up. Maybe change some of the flooring around, you know, make it look nice. This is all I need right here is a microwave and a stove top. I'm good to go. Let's see if I can not open the fridge. Nice, cute little fridge. I like this one, honey. I like this one a lot, actually. Class C, which is like the half van up front. So have you decided that maybe this is an option for us? Well, now that I see like that this is like a 26 foot yeah in a class a now it kind of like opens up more of the door so the one thing that i like about this is for this smaller uh for like not one of our like ultimate future big old huge motorhomes mm -hmm. is it doesn't have slide outs slide outs are awesome yeah but it's more things to go wrong right on an older motorhome once we buy Later on, our newer, bigger motor home will have slide outs, but like this thing has cool. an oven. It even some has a little chopper. Some of them don't have an oven, it's just a cook a stove top. Yeah. So this has an oven, microwave. Oh, it has fridge. an oven and a stove. Huh? It's an oven and a stove. How cute. So, like I said, it's just cool that it doesn't have, um, you know, that it doesn't have, um, it has a little cable thing here. So you can put like a little cable TV, thing. Yeah. I mean, I like it, I think so, it's really nice. This is actually something you check out the bathroom. Oh wow, it has like a TV literally right there. I didn't even see that until just now. Yeah, I checked out the bathroom. She's being so good. I know she is, cause she had a little bit of food, I think. She's better. Oh my God, you guys, I totally forgot to turn on the camera for this first coat of paint. So what I did is I put one coat of the Kills Primer on it. It's actually the Kills Premium. So we're in the middle of renovations. Don't worry, we haven't put the baby in that. Oh, Trav just took the wallpaper strip off, which is that yes. border. Trav just took it off this wall, which she did in and really fast amount of time, <laughs> I'm impressed. And I am over here, supposed to be taking my strip off and that's how far I've got it. But I also have the little one attached and she is out, so it's a little bit harder to do stuff with her, you know, attached to me, but we're getting it done. We're working on RV, getting this 
dated wallpaper off the walls. So I wanted to go ahead and give you guys a little sneak peek of some of the renovations that we have done only in the back of the motorhome and we got new carpets and floors and then we painted the back like the bedroom area so this is what it looks like it's nowhere near being done we still have to put blinds and all that but we actually stayed in the RV with no blinds and it rained the whole next day but it was still really fun. Chasing fame and being pretty all the time Doesn't sound like fun You can do better Let me show you what a good time looks like You can do better So much better I want Let yourself be free and maybe you will find that there is more to life than being pretty Honey, let's just face it You can do better Let me show you what a good time looks like You can do better So much better Good morning everyone, welcome to the snowmobile. Got wanna hear this engine start up. Chevy 8.1 V8. Oh, there we go. Okay, the snowmobile is turned on. We got full eight cylinders firing right now. Put this thing in drive. Actually, technically, this is gonna go in overdrive so we get a little better. Yes, mileage. Here we go, kiddos!
this is what's currently going on in the bathroom. If you tell me what to do at the top, I can probably start <laughs> Whoa! Uh, as you can see, this is the one part of the RV that hasn't been remodeled yet. And the only other thing are these chairs, which I think eventually we'll get these reupholstered. But they're a little pricey and they're totally fine for now. Um, we couldn't find covers that like fit them properly that we liked. So we'll probably just wait to get these done. And then the only other thing are, is the dash. Yeah. Like the dash part is kind of like this, I don't know, like beige color or something, which doesn't really match like the gray and white that we have going on. But, uh, we don't really care. It doesn't bother us that much. This stuff is getting done. Oh, I thought we oh, already started taking the things off. We're going to get a new light for up there. That little like. You thought what's already done? I said you already started taking cabinets off. We got the cabinets and the mirror off. Well, Travis did everything, obviously. And as you can see, this is what it looks like right now. And then we're going to paint it. I'm here for moral support. I'm actually taking care of the babe. Job gets the work done and then um yeah we'll show you guys what it looks like after stay tuned all right so this is where we're at right now doing some of the edges and then doing the inside and unfortunately with white this ultra pure white you have to end up doing two three coats of stuff so that is where we're at gotta do this back wall and still down here the mirror is going right over that, so I don't need to do that middle section. Removed all the cabinets and all the hardware, and then we kind of did a degreaser, so we took like a cloth. But we used um, this liquid sandpaper and took cloth and wiped down all the cabinets. And then once that was dry, then we took a paintbrush like this one and went in all the grooves of everything and then we did the rest with a roller brush and then right now to like kind of just clean off any yucky residue that was left over we're using acetone and we're using it on the light fixture to clean that because we're just going to spray paint it and then also for the mirror he's wiping that down with a cloth with this acetone stuff and then we're just going to use this flat black rust-oleum spray paint and then we also used bear which i don't know where it is the bear paint so as you can see this is the roller that we used and then that was to get in the grooves and it's just because it doesn't leave streaks that's why i use a roller instead of a brush and then this is the paint that we used to paint the wallpaper in the motorhome and our cabinets there's other stuff that we tried that was actually four cabinets um and it was horrible so this is what we found that worked best for us so just thought i'd share that in case anyone was interested or curious And stuff done. I gotta get you a sheet. Dry before we have to do another coat. I'll get a sheet. And Grandpa yes. and Dad and Snowball <laughs> were on the Harley. Oh. Did she not like it? What do you need, yeah. Yes. Okay. I, was, I got the thing so it that is? we could show her on there. Okay, let's go for a ride. Snow bear. Let's go for a ride. So a little something custom I did is this flooring, I got strips of it and I've used it for all of the shelf lining for everything through all of the stuff. So now it matches the floor and then of course acts like a shelf or acts as a shelf liner. That's how you do custom work. You're keeping me on. Ta-da! Bathroom is done. It looks amazing. My husband did such a good job. So proud of him. And yeah, this is what it looks like. He even put these little liners in. Even in the bottom, he put the liners in. Looks so good. Good job, baby. Uh, the only thing is, is like the actual counter <clears throat> i don't know what to do there if you guys have any good ideas let me know i'm thinking the same thing for like this counter 
and then also this counter. Don't mind our messy motorhome, but we're getting ready to take off soon because it's getting late on a Saturday or Sunday. Sorry. Uh, I need to clean up this motorhome and then we'll be good to go. But super stoked on the bathroom. Good job, babe.